Welcome back everybody, Drin68 Plays. We're playing Kenshi here. If you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. If you really like to see, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notify bell. We are going to try and go um, check out that Dust Bandits. The Dust King Tower. Let's see what's going on with it. No, no I don't want to go that way. Dang it, go this way. Speed us up a little bit. Stop us there. Ah, jeez, speed. Seriously? get up on that hill before? Did I have to go up this way? Oh, I was just going to go... I could just went this way. So just trying to get us a little bit down the road, get up to the Dust King's Tower in this episode, and then we'll do the, the travel down to the way station in the next one, maybe. Uh... this way. <sighs> we went up this way. Right? It's like very, very specific how I have to get there. It's like there's only one pathway up, and I don't know where it is. So we go down and around. I think we had to go around, didn't we? I don't remember how we got up there the last time. I think we had to come up this way. Right? Yeah, that looks familiar. Because I ran into some dust bandits here when I was coming up to the place. Now I'm just going straight up. Come along, come along. I think this is the way up there. Yeah, there's a, they're back. Oh God, is the Dust King back here too? There's a lot of them up there. I don't know if we're strong enough to take on as many Dust Bandits. How many are up here? There's one, there's two, Three. There's a dust boss. Four. Five. A couple of dust bosses. Okay, where are we? 
we are down here. I don't know if we're strong enough, guys. We're going to try it. One, two, three, four, five. There's a couple of bounties in here. Looks like there's maybe eight or nine of them. I don't know. Uh, problem is, is I'm the guy that has to do the opening of the lock. All right. Uh, Okay, that should have helped my lock picking some. Okay, now we've got to go inside. Right. So everybody come inside. That's right, go up there and beat on those guys. Oh god, look at how many there are. This was probably a bad idea. doing us sir holding your own but you're not doing that great boy scout Rutka why are you guys inside Looks like we might. Come on, Griffin, get up here. Yeah, there we go. So it looks like we're going to succeed, but oh my goodness. Dog is down. Rook is down. Take these guys out already. Oh, you're gonna... Jeez, oh, come on, people! Why can't they just stay down? Ugh, what a nightmare. Okay, that's only eight minutes in, and we are beat all to heck. Dog's unconscious for a long time. Well, Kang's not too bad off. Rain's not too bad off. Rootgood got whacked on really good. Esser did okay. Boy Scout's got some problems. Uh, can he repair himself? Get himself back up a little bit. Uh, dying, that's good. Dying, that's good. Dying. Unconscious. This is a dust boss. Dust bandit. 
Problem is, I have to carry that dust boss, that dust boss, a long way, and I don't really have anybody that can carry him real well. Uh, for a lousy two thousand cats, because you have to take him to a city. City, you can't just. Is that a recovery coma? Conscious. He's unconscious. <sighs> so, Boy Scout, why can't you heal your left arm? Oh, because I have it and pause. He's got to heal himself up. Uh, you need to recover. Kang, you can go inside. Let's see if the dust boss is actually in here. Who is this guy? He's just a dust bandit. Just attack him and get it. Get in now. Get in, people. Yes, they're going to keep standing up. We're going to have to keep fighting. Over and over and over again. Kang, I want you to go up a floor. And let's go up another floor. Click anybody's in here. <sighs> Damn it. to go up one more. I just want to see what's up here. There's nothing up here on the top tower, right? Oh, that's why we're all hungry. Pearl cup. I need that for one of my things, I think. I think I need that for something. Okay. So, uh, okay, come back down here and start beating on people. Gotta see how many of these people are actually alive. Okay. He's dying. He's dying. Dying. Dust boss is only unconscious for 21 more minutes. He's dying. Roman is dying. Dust boss. I have a couple of dust bosses. Maybe I should just grab them, run back to the hub, we'll recover ourselves, and run these guys down to the Shek Kingdom. Maybe I should just do that. Right? Oh, this dust boss is dying. Another dust boss. All right. Uh, well, let's... First aid, the dust boss. Oh, I can't move. Logan. Uh, Griffin. Somebody that can walk. No, which one? That one. No, 
I'm gonna first aid him. Um, I need to splint my injuries. Okay. How are you guys all doing? Probably need to splint yours too. He's okay. He probably needs to have his. Nope. Alright, so we've got a dust boss here. So I have a rooker. Come over here. Let's loot this guy first. Take away his weapon. That's worth 705, 318. Three. He's got good stuff. And then Rutger's going to pick him up. And we had another dust boss here. Somewhere. He's playing dead. So Kang is going to loot him so that he'll wake up and we'll knock him down again. Kang can't loot him. Alright, uh... And give that to uh, Griffin. Ah, oh, Griffin. Splint your injuries. Get over here. Kang. Take this. Okay. Uh, Griffin. And then Kang. You're going to pick him up. Let's pick him up. Now there's one more dust boss I think Rain the Giant has to get. So this was a little bit different. I was not expecting this. Uh, is this the one? No. That's a dust boss. So let's have Rain the Giant pick up this dust boss. Oh, we gotta loot him first. We can't let him have his stuff because he'll be very nasty. And then... That's the one that we want to pick up because he's worth money. Okay. All right. Um, we're going to go back home. Um, I suppose we could try to loot all these other guys. They really aren't worth looting. All right. Who we got left? He's dead. He's dying. He's critical. He's dying. He's still going to get up. He's in recovery coma, so two of them are going to survive. <sighs> what about this one up here? He's in recovery coma. And he's dying. So there's several of them are dying, and like three of them are going to stand back up. So we're going to wait a few seconds. Blood lost tail. Okay. So I don't have to worry about these guys coming after me. So let's see how slow we move. It's our slowest. 16. 11. Rutger is the slowest. So we're not going to move very fast. That's okay. 
we are going to head back to our place. No, stop it. To recover. Okay, so we're just going to try to get home from here. We can get 6,000 for those guys down in check after we recover. Might have to build some. See, Boy Scout's taking some permanent damage on his stuff. That's why you need skeleton beds. So we're not going to move very quickly. No, we don't want to go that way. We want to go over this way. That way? This way. Okay, we are going that way. We just have to go down and around. That's right. Okay. And now it's just a matter of us running all the way home. Okay. Running home with our prizes. Let's see if these guys try to get off our shoulders. Go down there. And down this way. So let's go here first. So we don't try to go over rocks. Or through the water. So with the mercenaries, we were just barely enough to take out all those dust bandits, like three dust bosses worth. That's a lot. Okay, now we're so down this way. I guess. Just keep going down this pathway, right? This camera thing always fools me because it's like wide at your side and point up here. So, uh, we should go up this way. And then around, and we should see our home, so to speak. Or at least see where we can get to relatively quickly. We do have a lot of banged up people. Um... I take a chance and run really fast. Try and run ourselves home. And that's going to be it for this session. And then we'll uh, probably head out next time. We'll try and uh, go get our bounties. Actually, I might just do that offline. Because that's going to be kind of a rather boring thing. Where's my other people? Where's your root good company? Just get them inside here. So I'm probably going to have some people go sleep. Like Griffin's already sleeping. 
Esther's okay. The three check are okay. Logan probably should sleep, and so should I. So I might have uh, Rutger Kang, Rain the Giant, Esser, get themselves into a squad and grab some bandanas and just run down to Sh to Shek, uh, to the Shek City, turn in our bounties while the others are sleeping, and then come running back up here, and then we will uh, deal with that. I can probably have them take Dalg too. Oh, dog should rest. Dog needs to rest too, except I have I wish they had animal beds that you could build so that you could, you know, build an animal bed in a building or something and carry them in and lay them down. So. Alright, uh. It's in my. Let's take a quick look and see what people have been doing while we've been gone. To our totals we do need to get water probably uh, there's 22 there 39 there oh specialist grade assassin's rags some masterwork grade and specialist grade leather pants 28 leather so I can get more leather it's armor plating still lots of bandanas in this one so we're kind of filled up. We need to get the bandanas out of here. So, yeah. Alright, I'm going to do a little bit of this housekeeping offline, and I'm going to run down to the Sheck Kingdom, turn in my three bounties to get them off the board. Hopefully they don't come back when I turn in the bounties. And maybe we can start cleaning out some of the dust bandit infestations here. Alright. So if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. If you really like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notify bell. Be notified to upload videos and or schedule streams. Um, I'm going to divide things up and get people back to doing what I need them to do. Um, basically, everything is kind of just clicking in the hub. I have... Uh, yeah, I don't know why I tried to sign off there, but I have... All but one space filled with four feud cubes. So it's one, two, three, four, five. By one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, forty-five. And then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Six, and eight. Forty. F so four times. Or twenty times nine is one hundred and eighty. And then another, what, thirty-two? Yeah, another 32. I think I have enough food coops. Oh, and uh, I still have some leftover in here. So, yeah. Um, I don't think we have to worry about food for a little while. So I kind of stopped her from making food. So I'm not really sure what to do at this point. Oh, I wanted to see... If you got any uh, bolts made, right? Um, Nicole, did you get any bolts made? Oh my goodness. You made 13 regular bolts? Maybe I need to change the tech on this. Um, <laughs> I didn't realize you could make them that fast. Oh my god. Where's the arrow bench? Um, let's turn off the repeat queue. Because, wow. I think I'll make another. I think I want to make a few sets of toothpicks. Right? For my other guys. Let's do it that way. Let's see what happens. Okay, so he's going to be busy making bolts for a little while. Um, I do have these buildings that I need to do something with here. Um, I think Slink is...
didn't click on Slink. There is a problem with the uh, with the indoor buildings or whatever when you put them up like this that I'm having some problems with pathing up here to do this machine. She kind of stops underneath it but then can't reach it, so it's an issue. Hotlongs doesn't seem to have that issue. Hotlongs just bangs away over here, making iron plates out of the ore. I might need to send some people out to do some ore mining. But we've got, uh, you know, farms are going and everything's going. We've got wheat farms, we've got green fruit farms, we even have hemp farms going. Over here, somewhere. I don't think the hemp farms are really doing much right now because I don't have any place to store the hemp. So we got lots of hemp farms, which means I can make cloth all day long, which means I can make bandanas all day long, which means I can just make money. Give me 20 days and I probably have a million and a half. So, yeah, everything's going pretty good here in the hub. I have a couple buildings that I need to do something with. I don't know what I did with that building. One of these buildings is a battery building. But I do want to turn one of these into, like this one here, I'm going to probably turn into like a bar, put a few things in there for people that wander in the city to give me a few cats. Have a lot of chairs and things, places where we can just go sit down and not do anything. Have a few beds under a tent up on the roof and stuff, just like the other bars. Um, so, I mean, that's kind of long range, self-sustaining kind of stuff. Uh, the only thing I have to do is I have to run down to the wells to get water and um, cactus. So I may take some materials and go down and build another windmill or two and then like two, maybe four more wells. I'd like to be able to pull a hundred water on a go. Because right now, as I can get it, I was like 50, I think. And it does take a little while for them to refill, so they use up the 50 really fast. I can't really get ahead of them. The alternative is to find a mod that lets me build indoor wells, and I just build wells by each of the farms. And then I just go stack up the water up here for the cookers. You know, I can do that too. Uh, I did try to see if I could put a a f body furnace, a, a corpse furnace, inside one of the buildings, and it doesn't seem to want to fit anywhere. So I can't do that, which would have been nice if I could have gotten that to be in there. Then we could clean up the dead bodies and keep the bone dogs away. But that's the way it goes. Okay. So we will come back here next time. Uh, Mercenaries are patiently watching Griffin sleep while he gets his left leg back. I should probably put myself in a bed. And Logan should go in a bed. And I think I'm going to have Boy Scout since we've got the time. He's just going to go ahead and get in the bed, too. We'll just have everybody run into their beds. And we'll reset the squats here. So we want to have... These guys and five. We're going to put them in Boy Scout Troop. 
right? Because they're going to run down and turn in the bad guy. And then we'll sell off the equipment that we've got. We'll pick up some bandanas and then we'll head down there. Okay? We will get Boy Scout to come with us at that time. Okay, uh, get myself back over here. All right, so I'm going to do that offline, I think. But just so you can see what I'm doing. Uh, when we come back, hopefully I'll have everybody healed up. We'll have done a money run. Uh, get these guys turned in for some cats down at the Sheck Kingdom. Um, get ourselves back up here, and then we will uh, and sell off a bunch of those bandanas. And then... Uh, I think I have her making blackened plate now. Plate mail. Do I have her building? I don't have her doing anything. Okay. So I could have her start making some black plate jackets. Because we're going to need those. But I need to get the bandanas out and sold. And then she can make some black plate jackets to get us, get all of our farmers and our new people into some decent armor. So she's going to have to build like six of them, I think, or more. Right? Right. Okay. Alright, so that's what we're going to do offline. Alright. I'll get all that set up, give you a quick recap when we get back, and yeah, so if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. You really like to see, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the notify bell. Be notified to upload videos under scheduled streams. Uh, I will come back in a little while, um, probably in a day or two. I have some other things I have to get done before I get another one recorded. Uh, hopefully I will get the ones I have recorded. I will spend uh, the next little while uh, editing or chapterizing them, you know, marking the, the places where we do things and getting those uh, posted up to YouTube. And then, um, yeah, I'll do this little... Uh, bounty hunting run along with bandana selling run down to the Sheck Kingdom and get myself back and then we will set ourselves up to go uh, run over to uh, Black Desert City and uh, Black Stretch. Who knows, I might even try to run down to Brink to see what's there uh, with the whole big nasty crew there and just see how we do getting across the planes. We will we will hire at least one mercenary company to come along with us just so that we have extra people to absorb some hits if we get ambushed by anything. Okay? Okay. Thumbs up. Hit the notify bell. Or subscribe and hit the notify bell and you'll be notified to upload videos and schedule streams. I'm Dren608. Until we meet again, stay safe and bye-bye.